Jump up.
Hi guys, I am back home now with my haul from the jumble sale. Now I got this coat, as you can see, it's vintage, it's gorgeous, it's got beautiful buttons on it. It is real sheepskin, but I mean they were from the 70s, uh, Richard Draper, real sheepskin. And coats were 50p, so uh, yeah. Unfortunately, after I got it, where is it? I did notice a hole here. A hole here. So I'm going to have to sell it with hole included and with stains included. But for 50p, I mean, I don't know what I'll get for it. I'll have to look at comps. But more than 50p anyway. So I was happy with that. Next, I got these monsoon trousers i think they're quite nice they're lined they are size 12 so not too bad and normal clothes were 25p so that was 25p i love it um i picked up this dress it's a bodycon dress i forget who it was by oh ax paris there we go so that's quite a nice little one. Oh, i got a a sheet for the girls room i found this cool top that says queens on it nyc which is quite nice not sure what that will sell for i found this one for me with the hamza hand on it which i really like and here comes the ice cream van <laughs> it is a nice day so why not have an ice cream i found this cute little red top with this detail on the zip. Anyone for an ice cream? Uh, this red top is also a monsoon one. <laughs> oh, he stopped, he stopped. It's a 14, but I thought red was a really unusual colour um, for a sort of summer top. So hopefully that will sell. A red one we never know i got this top i didn't recognize the name where is it rugla rugla but i really like the design on it it's quite a big top but look at that that is lovely i'm not sure of the size let's see if i can find that oh there's a label it says medium to large. I suppose, do you wear it oversized? And the pause. Okay, ice cream van is gone now with the chatty people outside my window. So, bye bye. Bye bye now. Do they not realise I'm trying to film a video? Honestly. <laughs> anyway, I got this uh, Reebok top. I thought it looked quite vintage actually. Um, this. Uh, believe it's a single stitch i don't know i'll have to do some research but it's a size 12. i don't think that would fit me as a size 12 but anyway i got this cute little dress with a netty bit at the top a denim one that's nice i got this harry potter top hogwarts i just like the detail around the top there I think it's just a Primark one, but it's a very nice, I like the grey pattern. I got this nice dress, oh it's inside out, hang on, do -do 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 -do. look at this, woohoo, swish, this is from Lipsy, and like I say, clothes for 25p, so I'm not complaining about that, that would go nice, hashtag weddings, I got this, uh, skirt which i know is a bit autumnal um but it's just m and co but i thought it's really nice and that would sell definitely i got this jumper actually i was going to put it back but um it's got this detailing on can you see like it's got square shoulders but i did try it on and it comes into like a little puff 
each side it looks really good actually so um i don't know how i'm going to photograph it with that puff sleeve but that would sell oh i got this very nice new look size eight jacket which is just a little crop jacket but i thought that is perfect for the wedding season you can see yeah and it feels really good quality as well and it's lined and everything so that will be a good good one to sell i found this really uh creepy doll <laughs> which um has on the back of him her i don't know if you'll be able to see it at all but it says rosebud anyway made in england and uh i have looked them up and they're not really worth that much so uh, <laughs> we'll still stick him on um give him a clean up because he's a bit dirty a dirty baby uh what else did i get oh i got this really cool bum bag which i would have loved in the 90s because it's so funky look at that love funky patterns so yeah that would go for a nice penny funky 90s patterns i got a nice little tea cozy because you know you always need a tea cozy i got this um it's like an argo type cooker for the doll's house now the price has been taken off there but i used to do doll's house used to do doll's house <laughs> i used to have well i have a doll's house but I used to um, buy a lot of stuff for my doll's house. So I know that these are very expensive. So hopefully I'll find some comps and pop them up there. But yeah, that was a good, good buy. And I put these in my basket because my friend wanted new taps. And I totally forgot to show her. And um, they end I ended up buying them anyway. So, um, but I'm sure they'll sell because maybe, uh, I don't know. We'll have a look. But uh, I mean, they're brand new in the pack. Could always save them for just in case mine break down or something like that. I got this top, south side serpents, and inside it says Riverdale. And then I also found this one that says Riverdale too. And I was thinking, I know that name from somewhere. I need to find out what that is about. It's got to be some sort of TV show. River Vixens American TV show so yeah I hope I do that as a bundle and then hopefully they'll sell together so that was good I've got ooh, some knives and forks but I also got these look at these these are Swan brand you can tell there vintage looking not vintage but vintage looking uh, tea coffee and sugar canisters oh. I love these and I'm debating whether to give them or not but they do sell for about £23 and I paid a pound I think for all three I paid £21 altogether for everything that I got today um, and I got a George Foreman Foreman? I nearly said Formby George Formby yeah. George Foreman <laughs> that one yeah um, Lean green green machine thing for two pounds so the 19 pounds for the rest of it so yeah absolutely brilliant oh and there was this lovely coat too um look at this lovely thick coat from next but i think it's wool let me just uh we'll check wwwd oh no oh no i take it back i see it now 50 percent wool 34 percent polyester seven percent acrylic 5% nylon and 4% something else well nice wool coat for you size 12 oh yes very nice so yeah all together jumble sale I love it I love going there I just it's so exciting to go into the jumble sale and just be like oh what can I find so uh yeah obviously most of it is to sell on ebay um but when i do find things oh and i've this box as well but when i do find things and it's you know so cheap i absolutely love it and if they say oh that one's a pound i'll go yeah no problem because it's so cheap anyway so please look up 
jumble sales in your area and go because it is so worth the wait even though we had to queue for <laughs> went literally around the building like that but it was worth it and it was a little bit chilly but once we got in there once you get going and sifting through all those clothes and all the items in there they have a separate room for the other items we were good we were on a roll so yeah have a look for a jumble sale in your area <laughs> thanks for watching guys see you soon Click the link for my latest video and don't forget to subscribe and like this channel.